Hey, what's up guys? Mill Skull here. Welcome back to Final Fantasy 16 episode 17. When we left off, we uh went to the abbey and uh witnessed what is happening to the bearers of Rosaria. Oh. We got a thing. Are we going to make enemies? Oh no. It's Sid. Sid. Clive, you're not where I left you. Hurt your hand. I did, I. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't fling them around the way I used to. Think of it as my decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. Nice. to compare war wounds. We didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. <laughs> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. Sid! <laughs> oh. slave to a fate just like you I wanted to save her for a while I even thought I could but just because you think something doesn't make it true Sid Savior. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures, but instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. But Clive, I will say this. a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Accept that, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate? Look, lad, you've had a hard life. And I don't see it getting much easier. You might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you can save yourself. <laughs> I'll try. Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk. But I trust you'll take good care of the boy. Yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We best head back then. I wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. This is so awesome. Alright, so we're uh, continuing from last episode. Uh, we have, let's see. We're going to make for Eastpool. We also have what seems to be a side quest. Let's go take it. Let's go do it. Hopefully it's on the way. Here, you're that bearer who works for Martha, aren't you? Can you give me a hand? Curse my luck. I dropped my crystal off a cliff into the bloody swamp like an utter fool. Now, I've not got your knack, see, and I need that shard to chill my fish if I'm to take him to market. But it's just a short climb down. I'll make it worth your while. Sure. Might as well. I can't promise anything. Well, just promise you'll look. 
Ah, there may be one thing I failed to mention about the crystal. A creature might have already claimed it. Nice. Claimed it. All right, eaten it, but 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 only might have you understand. There were a lot of bog crabs down there. Nasty buggers, them. <sighs> Sounds like I need to break a few shells. Oh, don't worry. There, there, there weren't too many of them. A veritable walk in the marsh, as they say. The ladders right over there. <laughs> Makes it sound like so easy. Just like, just go down the ladder. No big deal. Just like a couple crabs. Okay, let's see. In the other ladder. And we're gonna go over here. And we're gonna jump down here. And we're gonna fight some crabs. Company. This one specifically. Get him, Yuli. Get him. It's over. Foul crystal. Okay, easy peasy. All right. Return this and then move on. Maybe. Unless another little side quest comes up. It's just easy money, right? Gotta take the easy money. crystal. A thin membrane of fetid muck covers this crystal, which still, in its holder, otherwise appears undamaged. You found it! Oh, thank you! What a guy. Longer out in the sun, and my catch would have made for poor eating indeed. Mushy fish. Be more careful next time. Oh, I will, I promise. No point casting my nets of a morning if I'm without a crystal to see the catch to town. There was a time honest tax paying folk could get new ones whenever they wanted. Can't now, though, not for love nor money. Crystals are scarce, and the Empire tightens its purse strings more every day. Lose this little beauty again, and I might as well scrap my nets and take to begging. Sweet. Give me that money's. Okay, then we're moving on. Yep. Crafting materials. Oh, really? Another one? Alright, what do we got? I have to find him before the Imperials do. Okay. I'll do that. Can't talk now, I... Oh, you're Clive, aren't you? Martha told me all about you. Word is you're a devil with that blade. Yep. You look like you're in a hurry. Where are you going? Not far, I hope. But I dare not waste a moment. It might cost a man his life. Sounds serious. What happened? Not so much what happened as what might. They've discovered he's a bearer, see? And now, one of his erstwhile friends and neighbors wants to see him clapped in chains. Where is this bearer? He wasn't fool enough to wait for the Imperials to arrive. Poor Sod took to the road, left his whole life behind. But they'll be after him before long. I need to find him and get him to safety fast. Here. If you've the time and the inclination, I could do with a hand. Will you help me find him? Sure. Of course. We bearers have to look out for each other. Thank you, Clive. With your help, we might catch up with him yet. His name's Norris. We need to find him and get him to Martha before the Imperials sniff him out. You found him yet? 
You won't catch a bastard standing around clucking like old ends. Holy moly. That fucking snake played me false, acted like he was one of us, and the whole time he was one of them. We need him caught and handed over to the Imperials. Hanging's too good for him. Well, go on then. If he gets away, I'll see you fitted for a noose. All right, Ronald. We were just leaving. Look, this one's here to help. I was just filling him in. Ha! Send a bearer to catch a bearer, is it? Not bloody likely. That's it. I'll find the bastard myself. Come on now, Ron. It's dangerous out there. We wouldn't want you to come to any harm. If you want something done right, you don't send a bearer. Clive, this might take a while. You start hunting our man, and I'll be along once I put Ronald's mind at ease. Someone said they saw Norris heading for the Fallen Gate. Maybe you could ask if anyone over that way knows anything. We have to find him. Don't let him slip through our grasp. All right, we can do that. Damn. Need to find this Norris before Ronald takes matters into his own hands. Bears are difficult to spot. crazy. What do you mean about being played false? I wonder. I mean, bears are you know. Not crazy, just... Are you the guy? That close, really? You don't know a man called Norris, do you? I do, as it happens. He ran off that way not too long back. Looked like he was in a right all hurry. And he had a lantern with him for some reason. You never known him to sail after dark. He was making for the marshes then. All right. Thank you. Okay. Off to get Norris. Jump off the bridge. It won't let me. Oh, it almost it almost you did. Barely have to step did I hear out front door these days before you're hmm. set upon by the beast called Oh, let's go get him. That's one of our branded. Are we taking it? You can't have gone far. I better keep my eyes peeled. Alright, Norris, where are you hiding? What's that? A lamp. A lantern. The one Norris was carrying, no doubt. At least I know which way he went. Yep, he's over in the abandoned house, I imagine. If it's abandoned. I wonder if that someone was Norris. Ooh. Some dude. Norris, I presume. Leave me be. You were never branded. So that's how you stayed hidden. Ronald sent you after me, did he? Set an imperial dog on his best friend. And when we were so close. I'll never forget the hatred in his eyes. Jeez. But it doesn't matter now. I will not become a slave. As one bearer to another, please. Don't do this. You know how they treat our kind. Ronald didn't send me. One of Martha's men did. He wanted to make sure you were safe. I don't understand. Martha takes in Paris. She's a friend. You can trust her. Believe me. We never knew. <laughs> I can't say I'm surprised, though. She has a kind heart. Kinder than most. Just wait here and stay out of sight. We'll be among friends soon enough. Thank you. There's few would have been so kind. And... Sorry. You're no Imperial dog. Far from it. <laughs> I've been called worse. Oh. I found a lantern back there. I assume it's yours. Thanks. I dropped it when those creatures attacked me. But... If I'm honest, I wasn't all that sorry to be rid of it. Ron gave it to me. All right. I'll keep hold of it. 
I might be able to use it to put an end to the Imperial Surge before it begins. Okay. Bear without a brand. To have lived free for so many years. Only to be betrayed by a friend. God, that's a shame. Okay, so we're gonna head back. Um, I could travel back, but it's not that far. And the loading seems to take longer than running if it's not too far away, you know? Ah! Stay away from the goodies, That's Mule. One of our branded. Do we take him in? Yeah, if you can catch me. You barely have to step out your front door. Can't catch me. Too fast. Too fast. Okay. There you are, Clive. How goes the search? Well branded. Have you found the bastard yet? Only what was left of him. A corpse torn apart by monsters. And this. Let me see that. No. It can't be. Shall we consider that the end of the matter then? Or do you need to see a body? No, no. I, I mean, I've no use for bearer bones. He's dead. Let that be an end to it. I only wish those whose job it was had done what they were supposed to do and spotted him sooner. Letting a bearer go about without a brand? It's not right, I tell you. Who want anything to do with me now, eh? There goes the bearer lover, they'll say. I'll be a laughing stock. Jeez. These guys are pretty small minded. Is it true, Clive? Is Norris really... He's alive. You'll find him in a hut in the marshes. He's expecting you. Oh, you crafty. Still, you did the right thing. Thank you. It's not much considering, but please, take this. Thousand buckaroonies? Come on, money. Ah. Oh, okay. That's worth a thousand. We'll take it. Okay. Look around. Okay, let's leave. Quick, before someone... Let's see. How are we getting out of here? We're going this way. Leave before someone, uh... Stops us again. And look at that. I have a slumbering chocobo. Welcome to the Brotherhood. You're free to come and go as you please. Even to the north. Now the bridge is fixed. Yep. Peace. Is this the builder? Don't you worry about them boards. I use good solid lumber. It's the base on the other side you want to be careful of. Oh, I'm not scared of them. Not at all. Um, speaking of, uh, not at all, let's see, abilities, I pro- yeah, I got so many, holy cow, um, should we, uh, it's an evasion, that's a cool move, it's like the best, we can master that. Oh, is that like tornado aerial blast? No way. Yes, we're going to learn that. Or should we learn... Should learn both, honestly. Dang, I should do Flames of Rebirth. Magic nullifying tornado that slowly hunts down nearby enemies and upon ensnaring them, inflicts multiple hits. Massive pillar of fire that... Oh, and this one restores HP. Let's do that. Yeah, I like it. Um, Let's see. Can I... That's kind of the same type of move. We'll do that. 
Flames of Rebirth. And let's see. Do we have a... Um, we don't have a thing for that. But we do have... Let's see. Um, we can do... So we can get rid of Scarlet Cyclone. And do... Let's see. I guess Badge of Might, right? Increases our attack by 7. Or I can do... The Will of Fire. Right? Because that ups our Rising Flames. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Oh, I've got so much more. Holy cow. Oh, those are the timely ones. I don't want those. Okay, cool. Right? Okay. Not I like it. Of light. It's spread even further south. Pushing yet more monsters down with it. I dare say we'll be seeing a few along the way. Oh, we, we will. Have to keep our wits about us. All right, let's try it out. All right, we're taking them down pretty easy right now. That's good. All right, so what's our route? I guess we just keep on keeping on, right? Beast against beast. Oh, nice. That move's awesome. Okay. Well, there's still one over there. Uh, why are you way over there? Fights with everybody, I guess. Oh, okay. I guess we're fighting these hornets now. Just string all the all the fights together. That's what we're gonna do. Might as well bring these guys in too, right? Are we good? We're good. Come over here. Oh, wait. I feel like we missed some items back here. Because I just ran off to go fight those other guys. Oh, and look at that. Adam and Toys. Shall we? Should I try not to? Maybe. Hmm. Remember, be aggressive, Muley. Get right up in their face. Oh, there's over 10,000. I'm proud of myself for that. Got to hear you, little small fry. Give them all you've got, boy. 
Dang it. Sick of Torgal. Damn Torgal. Uh oh. That was a failure. Ten thousand on our combos. That's good. Okay, are we done fighting these guys? I think we are. Alright, look around. No treasures. Okay, we're leaving. On the trail again. On the road again. Let's go this way. I see a little bad guy. Who built this fence? These guys are on the way, so... Okay. Oh, look at that. What, these guys are... Are these bad guys? I guess they are, aren't they? Um... No? Can't just sick them? Okay, well, watch this. No, <laughs> What do they think of that? That took care of him. And a little treasure. Sweet. I like it. Okay. Right, beast versus beast. Is that what we're doing up here? I could run around here forever, seriously. I have a lot of fun doing this. What is this? Oh, is that the... It's the same as the one back at the hideaway. Yeah. I can't remember what it's called. Doesn't seem to be working, though. Interesting. That's a thing. You there! Over here! Okay. Excuse me. I'll use that blade of yours. Curse my look. I branded. No time to haggle with whoever holds your leash. Wait. That's the slumbering chocobo you're wearing. You and the Marfrys, are you? Good. She won't begrudge me the use of you then. Well, there's wolves about. We tried dealing with them ourselves. Made out bait. Think we might swoop in and slaughter a lot. But we didn't expect the pack to be quite so bloody big. I expect the blight drove them here. They must have fled their homes for greener pastures. Hope empty bellies might make them easy prey. They've made them mean instead. Martha's no fool, so she must see something in you. Do us a favor and get rid of them, will you? Of course. Yes. All right. I suppose those walls pose a threat to everyone. Yep. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I'd wager the greedy bastards are still over yonder, finishing off our bait. Those. Little greedy. Well, you seen to every last one of them. Go and yeah. speak to my friend over the bridge. Bryce, his name is. He want to know if it's safe to come across. All right. Oh, it will be. Then. It will be. Okay, let's go. Oh, that ain't bad. There's only a few starving wolves. Okay. Here goes, right?
There we go. Oh, that's an alpha, okay. Find this Bryce. Let him know the road's safe. Alright, well. Some hungry little wolfies. Is that a minotaur in the field? Where are we? Okay. He's up that way. Is that another minotaur? What's going on? Hmm. I'll go fight this one. Crab out of or this guy out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. He's gonna charge. Not this time. Oh, he got me good. He got me real good. Dang, dude. <laughs> Why is he hitting me so hard? Okay, get it together, Muley. Nothing fancy, okay? <sighs> Dodge too early. Why do I do that with Minotaurs? Seems like I do it with Minotaurs only. Get that stagger. There it is. My wounds, boy. Oh. Dang, that was a rough one. What else we got going on? What are you doing? Why are we shooting over there? Shoot that one. A little help. Okay. We good? Holy moly. I feel like I kind of got my butt kicked. Used up all my high potions for some dumb reason. Okay. Anyway. This way. Let's just... Oh, well, I already came over here. There's got to be something hiding, right? There's got to be something hiding. Another minotaur. Looks like there's a wyvern over there. Jeez. Fine. Sorry, buddy. We're gonna keep our distance from you. As much as I can. You just swing at nothing, okay?
try it. Jeez, I feel like I did a cool move there. That uh, deadly embrace in the air was awesome. Okay, I was uh, treasure hunting. Where are we? There it is. And that. That's not a regular wyvern, is it? I kind of want to go see. I'm super curious. is the way we were back here oh this episode's going on okay my friends I want to thank you all for watching I hope you enjoyed this episode we're gonna make our way towards uh, East Pool next episode so until then I will see you then bye <laughs>